Alrighty, welcome back everybody. How's everybody doing today? Y'all better be doing good because it's a good day because we got a new clutch. Because this one here is uh, smoked. I went up underneath it and uh, the inspection cap is full of clutch. It's just all the fibers and everything is full. So we have a good old dual disc back there, full ceramic. We got a refurbished, we got a rebuilt flywheel with it as well. So he said it should withstand 1,000 horsepower. So hopefully we don't blow this one. I know we're pushing way over 1,000, but what the heck was that just bounced off the windshield? Probably some stupid ass bug. Well, look at this here. Is that the clutch that's left of it? Oh, that's not good. That's not supposed to be in pieces like that. Uh-huh. Look at all this. <laughs> That's nice. You can smell it. Oh yeah, it smells nice and good. <laughs> no. This thing is smoked, boys. This was brand new like two weeks ago. <gasps> Look at the back side, there's nothing on it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Very nice, very nice. So we've been here about two hours and now we're putting the clutch back in. The new one. We already got the flywheel in. So you just gotta put this boy in. Very nice. This should not burn up at all. If it does, well then we're gonna eat it. So we got this thing down on the ground, now everything's in. It took us just under four hours to do all that. So now we're gonna go on a test drive, see how she does. Go on. All right, if y'all missed the last video, we got this uh, big old S472 on here, VGT. It is a mechanical VGT setup. Um, we got that dual disc in here, got about a 200 miles on it, just about the break-in period. Um, we got our 215P pump in here, maxed out. And it rips, let me tell you that, it rips. So let's go out there, break in this clutch a little bit more. Skinny pedal, bitch! He's, are you stalling it? Put it in first! What the hell? That thing's a peep. Yep, yep, skinny pedal, skinny pedal, go! Oh my gosh. What a pile. 6-0 over here, boys, non-BGT. First is a, looks like a Dura turd. He looks like he's ready. Dale, boys. We got a Mustang and a Charger. Everybody back up, everybody. Back up. Got a Mustang. Oh. Ah, oh, dick. Very nice. Old boys got some ductwork back there. Mine's better, though, boys. Very nice. Old gal sound 
like a 6 0, boys. Get her going, 6 0. Back up non DGT, boys. Come on. Oh, camera's lagging. Oh, mini van! Ah! What we got going on up here? Idiots! Well, got T-bone. T-bone, idiot. Who's next? Got old Logan. Come on. Do something cool. Come on. Do something. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Old Caleb. <laughs> Clutch here is gone. All right, so we got Yeeter Beater stickers since we have a Yeeter Beater here, and this Yeeter Beater will not be revealed until we hit 100K because there's going to be a 100K Yeeter Beater series with this Yeeter Beater. We're going to make tons of videos of it. It's a good, strong Yeeter Beater, and that's why we're putting this lovely Yeeter Beater sticker on it because so everyone knows it's a eater beater. I always sell these at pretty much all the shows I go to. They're not on the website yet, but the stuff that is in the website is down in the description. So if you want some shirts, stickers, whatever else we sell, it's on the website. So go check it out while I install this eater beater sticker. These eater beater stickers automatically add about 100 horse to your eater beater. So you ain't got to do nothing to it. Just flap on the sticker and you're good to go because most eater beaters they're powerless they're gutless they're garbage that's why they're eater beaters so if you add this simple mod we'll add horsepower <laughs> rug burn you can't tell there's a nice mud hole here we tested it out in so there's gonna be mudding um, there's gonna be uh, a couple ditches we go through, some jumps. This thing's gonna go everywhere. Probably take it to the Badlands, maybe the sand dunes. So we're almost 200k. So once we hit 100k, then Yeeter Beater is gonna go around the world. Yeeter B. All right. So that video, this video is a little old. I recorded it like two weeks ago. I haven't had time to edit and upload it. So uh, yeah, so it's going out today. All the videos and everything I took from the mech this weekend, this past weekend, will be up. We'll be up in about two days. So you'll have that. I just wanted to get the dual disc out there. Everybody know I put a dual disc in her. So I just threw a whole bunch of clips together in here and... Hope you all enjoy it, but the video from this weekend is going to be out two days. So we'll see you all at the Mac.